Blow up a balloon inside of a bottle with the science of air pressure. Here's what you'll need. A plastic bottle, a balloon, a pin, some tape. First, stretch out the balloon. Once it's all stretched out, put the deflated balloon into the bottle and wrap the neck of the balloon around the bottle opening. Try blowing up the balloon. It doesn't blow up. What if we make a hole in the bottle? Now try blowing up the balloon. Careful not to cover the hole. It inflates. Quickly cover the hole with your finger. Seal it with some tape. You'll see the balloon won't deflate even though the bottle isn't sealed. Now try this. Take the tape off and let the balloon deflate. Put your mouth on the hole you made in the bottle and try to suck the air out like this. You've inflated a balloon without even touching it. This happens because you're reducing the air pressure in the bottle by sucking out the air. So the balloon expands to equalise the air pressure. Ever wondered why there are two holes in the lid of your takeaway hot chocolate? Design engineers put it there to allow the outside air to enter your cup balancing the air pressure created by you gulping your drink. Design engineers are super creative, researching and designing products we use every day, from cars to furniture and mugs.